Okay, empty bowls. I'm going to get a plate now. Um, hot and sour. That's what I couldn't think of while I go. It's hot and sour soup. Egg noodle soup and the, and the wonton soup. And so now I'm going to show you everything. Okay, here's the soup bar over here. These little crispy things, I don't know what you call them. They're pretty tasty to put in the soup. But it would be high glycemic. And I just came from the doctor and he was chewing me out. So, <laughs> Here's, I love when the Oriental places started doing this. They used to put it in the soup already. This is the wonton. It's like a meatball of some sort or meat, whatever, compressed and uh, with the noodle surrounding and inside the soup. The soup is kind of like chicken noodle, but uh, anyway, it's a good soup. And they used to put it in there and somebody would take all the wontons out. All you'd have was liquid, but they started putting wonton separate and you can put as many as you want in there and it works out better there's always some left otherwise there was no never any left <clears throat> okay fried shrimp some sort of little donut I don't that looks like a fried fish of some kind like a fried wonton not, or dumpling is what they call it some, some uh, buffalo chicken wings you notice all the Oriental buffets, they always have a handful of Americanized items which the kids will eat. Because I wouldn't, as a kid, I don't tell me to get something mixed up with all the vegetables. <laughs> as a teenager, I began to think, well, bro beef and broccoli is okay. And then as I got older, I, I like it now. I like all the vegetables in it now. But uh, that's honey, what is that? Yeah, honey chicken, that's very good. That's like a crab, no, that's a cheese wonton. A crab and cheese type wonton, sour cream wonton, those are good. That's a spring roll, it looks like fries. This is, what is this? Ch a chicken nugget, that looks like another chicken something. Apple pie, I don't know what that is. <clears throat> I'm not looking at my camera, I don't know if I was pointing at this stuff or not. I keep my finger out of the way for crying out loud. Plenty of plates, huh? I've always enjoyed the fish. I don't know what type of fish. It usually looks like salmon. That doesn't look like salmon right there. Crawfish, I, I never eat them like that. I love crawfish tails, but I never eat them like that. Swai fish, this is a fish dish. You can see the fish there. That's very good. I've had this and it's flavored slightly, slightly on the hot side. Not bad. Uh, potatoes, which are very good. Then you've got salt and pepper shrimp, which are very good. Of course, you got to peel and eat them. Teriyaki chicken barbecue, it says. Uh, salt and pepper squid. I do not eat squid. In spite of it being seafood, it just tastes like a rubber band to me. Kung Pao chicken. There's a whole bunch of shrimp. Shrimp mixed vegetable. Chicken and broccoli. Beef and broccoli on the other side. This is black pepper chicken. That's pretty good. Mongolian beef. I don't know if I had it or not. The green beans, which are done, they're kind of sauteed, I think. They're done differently than American green beans. Of course, your rice and your uh, lo mein, and that's like a rice noodle across the way. Uh, the sign's gone, it doesn't say what it is. It's tasty, but it's very thin. Anyway, all that would be high glycemic. So, if you're like me, you gotta go light on that. You got sesame chicken, which is very good. You got coconut shrimp, which is very good. And the sauteed mushrooms, I've really, in my later years, I've really started liking cooked mushrooms. As a child, it was anathema. <clears throat> and clam with oyster sauce. If I'm in the mood, I'll eat that. They're not as good as like if you get in a different, like a seafood restaurant. Um, orange chicken is very good. Then you got your bowl of steamed shrimp and mussels and 
lemons and eggs and cucumbers and salad stuff, cottage cheese, dressings. And here you have dessert stuff and snacky stuff. Fruit, grapes, orange, pineapple, jello, and and like uh, mandarin type oranges down here and whatever that is. Cookies. I, I love these uh Oh, what do you call it? Almondine? What do you call that when it's almond? It's uh, amaretto. That's what I'm trying to say. Love the amaretto cookies. Animal crackers. <laughs> this is the only place in the world I've ever seen animal crackers on a buffet. And there's that soft serve you can do down there. Okay, now I'm going to put the phone up and grab something.